Hey, what's up? How you doing? This is Daddy T. Welcome to my channel if you're new, and if you're not, welcome back. Glad to see you again. So tonight, the family and I are going out to Royal Host. It's a very well-known diner chain in Japan. It's been around for quite some time. It's all over and not exclusive to Yokosuka, so please feel free to watch this. However, this particular one is located in Yokosuka at the address below. So what do you say we learn something about this place and check out this menu? Cool? But first, don't forget to subscribe by hitting the subscribe button below this video or the small red square in the bottom right corner of this video or follow us on Instagram at DaddyTJapan. So Royal Host, like any other restaurant, has a story behind it. So back in the 50s, a famous baseball player by the name Joe DiMaggio and his then wife, the late Marilyn Monroe, came to Japan on a honeymoon. They then ate at the Royal Diner and loved their onion soup so much that they reportedly ate it for several days. Now this made headlines and it only helped the chain succeed. And now they have more than 200 locations all over Japan, starting from their Fukuoka Pilot restaurants. Pretty cool. Now Royal Host prices are slightly higher than its competitors, such as Saizeria, Denny's, and Gusto. But you also get quality here. Now some of the portions can be smaller than expected, so be ready for that. But then some of them are just right. Also, they do not, do not take Western cards here. I have been to so many of these places all over Japan, and they won't take Western cards. Your Japanese card will work here, and they will take cash. So plan ahead if you want to come here. You will also see other restaurants more on the western side of Japan or even at the airports simply called Royal. This is its original name before changing it to Royal Host in the 70s. So expect the menu to be very similar but the decor may look different however. Now let's look at the menu. So you can see that they have Wagyu beef, steaks, pastas and more. I like to come here for the seafood honestly. They have tasty shrimp and the scallops, or hotate as it's called in Japanese, is super good. I think I already know what I want. Now the salads are good to go. I'm also thinking some garlic bread ought to do it. Of course french fries for the kid. Not a complete day without that. They almost demand it actually. But they're going to have to eat more than fries this time though because they have a nice kids meal option. Also, the drink bar option can be paired with any meal and is 330 yen per person, but only 210 yen if you come during lunch hours. And we will go up and check that out later. Well, now, we always say the word wagyu, but I know full well that some of y'all don't even know what that means. <laughs> so I'm going to teach you. So check it. If you ever see the kanji for wagyu, wa simply means Japanese or Japanese style, where gyu means beef. So put it together, Japanese beef. But it goes deeper than that, you see, because these Japanese cows, to date, there are only about four main breeds of them here in Japan, and they hold a marble-like appearance and their beef, so to speak, due to uh, muscular fat cells. And their production is highly regulated by the organization Zenwa, as you can see on the menu. And the Japanese government has banned the exportation of these cows so that they remain Wagyu. So enjoy! You can also find some great quality Wagyu at quality supermarkets. Prosciutto ham salad with parmesan cheese and some dressing on top. Now they make it really good here. You can get this salad at a lot of places like Denny's, but I like the one here very much. Here's some french fries with the mayo, oh yeah. Now I wasn't a big fan of mayonnaise until I came out to Japan. They like to mix this up with ketchup if you request it, or sometimes they just do it by default. Delicioso. Here is yet another salad. Now you can't get enough of them greens in your system, folks. Stay frosty by staying healthy. Okay, now let me try this. I gotta try this. 
I got the green cheese, tomatoes, potatoes, shrimps, eggs, bacon with the onion and the dipping sauce. I made it! Okay, I did it. Pancakes at 6 o'clock at night? What is this? Actually, they tasted pretty good. I really won't lie. You see that chocolate syrup? Couldn't resist. Now here's my other daughter's meal with a little dessert. Mm -mm. I'm actually hoping she don't eat that. Wife's meal. As you can see, we ordered a lot. Now this is the garden steak pilaf with fried onion on top, pumpkin on the side. Yes, sir. Now you see when the kids are happy, DT is happy. And finally, I get to eat. Here is my meal, the gathering platter. The gathering! Now I explicitly asked for them not to put peanuts on my salad or the peanut oil that came with it as a dressing on top of the salad because of my allergy by saying allergy ga arimas or I have an allergy then I said natsu nuki de or without nuts this kept me from flaring up because I don't want to ruin a perfectly good family night out it just ain't worth it it's like you just can't win no more you can't win I'm always on the lookout for the nuts. <laughs> Wait for it. <laughs> Sounds funny, but I'm serious. Oh and finally, my God. remember to bring cash if you want to eat here. Can't stress that enough. If you don't want to be that guy holding up the line, messing up your family night out, I've been there. Luckily, my wife had her Japanese credit card on her, but they always take cash, so that's great. So there you have it. You learned about the origin story about a restaurant that's been in business in Japan since pretty much after World War II. A good tip about eating here to save yourself embarrassment and a headache. And you know how to express that you have an allergy so that you don't get nuts or something that you don't want in your food. Now you see what I'm talking about when I say you just can't win no more. You just can't win. Like, subscribe, stay healthy. And you know what? See you in the next one. DT out. I got the green cheese, tomatoes, potatoes, shrimps, eggs, bacon with the onion and the dipping sauce. I made it! Okay, I did it. <laughs>